What's up YouTube? Today I'm back with part two to the damage mystery box battle. H1K vs Boom Loot. Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for taking time out of day to watch this video. Uh, like I said in the opening, we are back with part two to my damaged box battle run. Uh, it is H1K vs Boom Loot. Just a little bit of a recap. Uh, it is $83 to $171. 83 for H1K, 171 for Boom Loot. Um, it's a little bit of a disadvantage. Uh, Boom Loot is $65 and H1K I believe was like $45. Um, but yeah, I mean, it is what it is. It's a damage box battle run. Uh, we're going to see who comes out on top. Uh, this is part two. All right. But before we get into these two, I got a box that I hope ties into it. Uh, this was a trade that I did with the guy. His name is Jeremy. Uh, he's got a YouTube called Jeremy Collects. I'll link all his information down below. Go ahead, check him out. I uh, just hit a thousand subscribers not too long ago and he's shooting up the charts. I think he's up to like 1200 or 1300 subscribers. Cool dude, uh, but yeah, so I did a trade with him. He actually did a mystery box run not too long ago, or he opened up a mystery box run, and he got this pop in there. I quickly hit him up, let him know that I wanted to do a trade, and uh, I ended up trading with him a, what did I trade for? I traded um, Dobby from uh, anime, or an anime pop. It was a NYCC shared sticker. Uh, so we did a trade right there, and yeah, let's get into it. Uh, hopefully this goes into the H1K box because you have a chance to get some more of these pops in there, which I'm hoping for. Uh, yeah. Oh, look at this cool sticker. All right. So this is his sticker right here. Jeremy collects. Once again, I'll let his, uh, I'll put his information down below in the description. Yeah. Cool sticker. I actually got to get some stickers. All right. So this right here is the Breaking Bad Pop. This is my first Breaking Bad Pop so far. This one is gonna be the Mike Ehrman Trout. Ehrman Trout. Cool little pop right there. This is coming out in 2014, back in the day. But yeah, this is my first Breaking Bad Pop. I hope to get a bunch of these signed. I'm gonna try and get them all. Well, I'm trying to collect them all, just like I'm trying to collect all the, uh, the Walking Dead Pops. Uh, but yeah, so this ain't too bad a damage. I mean, for a box that came out in 2014, it's not bad. Um, you got a little bit of box wear, whatever, on the corner top up here. You know, you can kind of see it. But it's not bad. Not bad at all. I think this pop is going for $85 or so. I'm not too sure. If I find out the price, the PPG, I'll put it right up on top. But yeah. First Breaking Bad Pop. Thank you, Jeremy Collects. This is awesome. Happy to do this trade with you. All right, but let's get back into this. All right, so we're at $83 for H1K, $171 for Boom Loot. Not sure if I said that in the opening. Uh, so yeah, we'll put Boom Loot off to the side first, or off to the side, and we'll do H1K first, and we'll see how much value I can get out of this one. So if I find the information, I'll put it up here, see what the top hits were. But there are a bunch of Breaking Bad Pops, um, there's a bunch of other different ones. It was either $45 or $55 a box. Uh, but yeah, damage pops. Um, I don't think a lot of the ones in the past video, I'll link the video up top here of uh, round one, but they weren't too bad of damage. There were a couple damaged ones, but it is what it is. It's what you get. All right, so right here we got four pops. Oh, that's another difference. So there's four pops in the H1K six pops for boom loop so yeah we'll get into it so we got none in protectors we'll just pull them out and uh see what we get first one is jasmine from disney so this pop came out in 2017. it's got a sticker on top for seven dollars uh, I will also link my Mercari down below. If you guys want to buy any of these pops or if you want to do any trades, let me know. Uh, but this one I will not be keeping. Not a bad pop though. Seven bucks. 
get into pop two. All right, that's the back, and go. Ooh, Iron Man, bro. Okay, so this pop came out all the way back in 2012. I got it already. Uh, so it's got some whatever. They like peeled the sticker off up there. But the front's not bad. The side's got some, you know, some dings on the window. Little kind of like engravings, but like, this ain't a bad pop. Wow, dude, Iron Man, let's go. And it's got a little <gasps> crunchage right there, like someone pushed their finger right on it, trying to like maybe pull up and pop. That's cool, Marvel pop, hell yeah. I'll keep that. All right. Go. That might be the big hit in the box. I think that's over a hundred bucks. So wrong. All right, this pop, I can feel the damage. <laughs> All right, let's do this one in three, two, one. Dreamland Dumbo. This one is coming in at eight dollars. All right, this is a 2018 pop. Yeah, it's uh, it's got so it's got a uh, a rip or like a. A knife wound right on the top there. What did you say? And where else did I feel? It was uh oh, on the back side there. There's uh one of those creases right up there. Eight dollar pop, not bad. Alright, let's get into this last one. Three, two, one. Show in the back, show in the front. Fennec Shand. Star Wars book, book of Boba Fett. <laughs> this one is coming in at four whopping dollars. So yeah, so all these pops are, you know, what, four, eight, seven, and then the big one was the Iron Man. All right, but uh, let's look up some PPG for uh, this H1K box. All right, guys, and we're back. All right, so I looked up some PPG values, and man, I, I knew this pop had some value, but I didn't know it was that high. All right, but well, let's get into it. First, uh, we got the Boba Fett. This one was coming in at $4 and it actually went up in value to $9. So we got some money back there. Uh, this one, Dumbo, she put it at $8 at time of boxing. This is actually coming in at $9, so not bad right there. Uh, we also got uh, the Jasmine. This one's coming in at a whopping $7. Price did not change. Last but not least, the Iron Man. This one, so she didn't have a sticker on the top or maybe, no, that's not where the sticker was. But coming in at top, oh my God, this one was crazy. This one, $260, man. What? What did you say? $260. Okay, obviously it's damaged, so it's not gonna, you're not gonna get that much for it. I'd probably 175 for it, uh, cause the box is in some pretty bad shape. I'd say maybe like a, like a six out of 10 or five out of 10. It's bad, it's got some wear, but the, this pop came out in 2012 for God's sakes. All right, so, H1K came back with some value. This one, this box, is coming in at $288, bringing her box total for part one and two up to $368. I said she had to catch up some ground, and man, did she ever. Holy cow, let's go. All right, so let's put these pops aside and we'll get into the H1K box. What did you say? All right, so let's put this box aside and we'll get into the Boom Loot box. Be right back. All right, guys, and we're back. Uh, first, before we get into this mystery box from Boom Loot, why don't you do me a favor, go down below if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Uh, we actually just hit 300 subscribers, and for that, I'm gonna do a 300 subscriber giveaway. Uh, why don't you go down below in the comment section, put in there hashtag 300 club, hashtag 300 club. I'll run it for about two weeks, and then we'll pick a winner in a future video. Uh, but yeah, thanks for all the support, uh, but I'm really thankful for all the subscribers. I never even thought I'd get up to 300 subscribers. This is freaking amazing. I love you guys. <laughs> uh, but yeah, hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. Uh, hit that bell notification, know whenever I post new content. Hit that like button, do all the good stuff, share it with the friends. I truly thank you guys uh, for all the subs and I, I just, I love it. All right guys, so let's get into this. Uh, so this one, if I know, or if I 
remember the to put the picture in there i'll put it up right here of what the top hits were i just know the really big hit in here was the thor which you're trying to go for uh, i was like the og thor i think it's the one where they made thor and loki uh but yeah that would be super awesome to get if uh, if i could get it actually that would be freaking amazing but yeah 65 dollars a box you're guaranteed i believe 150 dollars in value of ppg and with boom loot if you've seen any of my other uh boom loot unboxings uh they're not really much damaged they don't come really much per they i mean they might have a little bit of shelf wear on them but like they're in some pretty good shape for damage run but yeah let's get into this let's crack it open six pops in here uh let's see if boom loot can catch up to h1k all right so we got six pops none in protectors so we'll just pick out the ones and uh on the ends and go from there all right first one in the boom loot damaged mystery box run is <laughs> what <laughs> jasmine that's freaking crazy <laughs> we just pulled this not too long ago <laughs> oh that's funny guys that's not funny that's not funny at all Oh, that's funny. Jasmine, so we already know that was, I believe, like $7. So yeah, let's get into number two. Number two is gonna be... Ooh, Black Panther. Special edition sticker. This is the Black Panther Black Light Pop. I don't know if I had this one. And once again, no damage on this pop. For a mystery box, damage box, this is, that's crazy. All right, Black Panther. Crazy, cool. All right, let's get into the next one. We'll do that one in three, two, one. Bang. Killer B from Naruto Shippuden. All right, so this one has the first part of, part of damage. Right in the back there, it's got that little crunchage, like someone put their, when they bent it in to take the pop out of the box. But yeah, we got a, we got an anime pop. Not too bad right there. You guys know how I feel about anime. If you want to trade for it, or it'll be up on Mercari, link down below. All right, we have three more pops left get in this bottom one right here all right three two one three two one three two one Bam. freddy funko Ooh, we got a freddy funko wow this one's coming in at 170 bucks it says so this is the 750 piece freddy funko as pinocchio wow bro that's awesome look at that two monster hits in these boxes oh my god and like I said, not much damage. I mean, it's pushing in a little bit right here, right here in the corner a little bit right there. But other than that, holy cow, Freddy Funk, 170 bucks. Not bad. All right, guys, I don't know I'm gonna top that. All right, let's get in this next one. We will do this one in three, two, one. Raven, ooh, look at that, Toys R Us sticker, Teen Titan Go. Wow, sweet. All right, this one came out in 2016. Um, I think Toys R Us are starting to come back in the States. Uh, they got them up in Canada. They went away for a while. But yeah, that's the old school Toys R Us sticker. Look at that. All right, not a bad one. Not a keeper for me though. All right, last one guys. We will do this one in a three, two, one. Spider-Man, Zombie Hunter Spidey. So I do have this pop, I know that for sure. This is actually the What If one. I uh, believe it's Metallic Walmart. But yeah, this pop came out in 2021. Not bad, another Marvel pop, I like it. Damage on this one is, I mean, there's that factory crease that's in a lot of Funko Pops, but uh, once again, really not much damage. All right, guys, so I'm gonna check out some PPG and I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. All right, so I looked up some PPG values and uh, this was a pretty good box as well. 
All right, so we'll first start out with Jasmine. She, right as we know, it's coming in at $7. Got that pop in the last box. Uh, Teen Titan Go right here is also coming in at $7. I thought it'd be more with the Toys R Us sticker, but uh, yeah, $7. Um, Infinity Saga, Black Panther, Black Light. This one is coming in at $8, so not bad there. Uh, we also have the Metallic, yep, it is Metallic, Zombie Hunter Spidey Walmart sticker. This one's coming in at $12. Now this one surprised me a little bit. So this, uh, who is it? Killer B from Naruto Shippuden. This one's actually coming in at $40. So that's awesome right there. Cool little anime pop. But the big hit out of the box was the Freddy Funko as Pinocchio, 750 pieces. A Little bit of a damage right here. So at time of boxing, it was 170 bucks. It's actually down to 160 right now. So that's not a bad hit right there. And it's not too much damage. So that's bringing H1K, or not H1K, that's bringing uh, Blue Loot's box to $234. Wow, guys, $234 total from round one and round two. Boom Loot is at a whopping $405. Guys, that is crazy. I paid $130 and I'm already up to $405. For, so $65 a box with the two boxes down. Uh, 130 bucks. I'm up to $405 value. That is amazing value, guys. So right now, as it stands, round two, we're coming in at 368 bucks for H1K, $405 for Boom Loot. So I mean, they're really close. Uh, we're getting lots of value, which is really crazy. Uh, All right, guys, and just like that, that's gonna do it for this video. Before we get out of here, I want to give a big shout out to the Timberwolves. They go into this game coming up. I'm not sure exactly when this video is gonna come out, but uh, they're going into game six. It's an elimination game. It's at home though, so hopefully we can come back. We're looking a little tired. I don't think it's gonna happen, but hey, you never know. Uh, but yeah, go down below in the comment section. Remember, hashtag 300 club for your chance to get into the giveaway for 300 subscribers. Uh, and also let me know which one was your favorite of the day. Mine is definitely going to be the Marvel Avengers Iron Man pop. Uh, it's a little dinged up in, you know, a box or whatever. But it did come out in 2012 and it is a Marvel pop. You know I love me some Marvel pops. Uh, but yeah, let me know which one is your favorite. Uh, like I say in every video though, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for taking time out of your day to watch this video. I truly appreciate everyone watching these videos. Uh, keep coming back and I'll see you on the next one, alright? Peace!